Well, our chilly temperatures are here pretty much to stay. We're expecting a really chilly weekend ahead. Right now, temperatures sitting in the 30s and 40s for some. Owatonna is still at 41 degrees, and it's still a little bit warmer out towards Rochester, too. Same in Mason City. The rest of us mainly sitting in the 30s, lower 30s, further out to the west. Marshall and Slayton at 32 right now. Same thing in Olivia. We're going to be seeing these temperatures continue to fall actually throughout the rest of today. Here's that wind chill right now too. We're going to actually be seeing with the, that high wind speed today, it's going to be feeling a lot colder than it actually is out there. Out in Redwood Falls, Marshall Slayton, 20 degrees is what it feels like at the moment. Even cooler than that in Olivia in the teens right now for that feels like temperature. Mankato feels like 31 right now. <clears throat> It's going to be a chilly weekend, especially with those outdoor, potentially outdoor plans for Halloween weekend. It's going to be a pretty chilly one out there. Temperatures for tomorrow. We actually already hit our high temperature for today early this morning. The rest of the day is going to be a steady decline in temperatures and then kind of remaining consistent throughout the afternoon. So tomorrow, though, we're going to cool off even more into the lower 30s for those highs by tomorrow afternoon. 33 for that high in Mankato and then further out towards the west. Some of us barely even making it into the 30s. Slayton projected to be in the 20s throughout all the day tomorrow. Right now, radar and satellite shows pretty clear conditions for the majority of us. However, we are still watching a few showers closer to Albert Lee. It looks like the majority of these, though, are starting to dissipate and lighten up a little bit. So it's likely that we're going to see this exit our area here in the next hour or so. Wind speeds are also still very strong, especially towards our west. We're seeing 20 to 25 mile per hour sustained winds right now. That's pretty breezy. That's blustery. It's going to be making it feel pretty unpleasant when you combine that with those actual cool temperatures. For the rest of the day, we are expecting that to potentially increase as we go further into the afternoon. Wind speeds remaining in that 20 to 25 mile per hour category. However, we could see wind gusts even higher than that. Very breezy conditions today. Good news is, though, we are expecting that wind to return back to normal tomorrow. Also, speaking of tomorrow, we are looking at the potential for our first snowflakes of the season, which is always exciting or scary, depending on how you look at it. Later on in the morning, we're going to start to see some of these snow showers pop up for northern Iowa. That's likely where we could potentially see a little bit more accumulation than what we're going to see in southern Minnesota. In the afternoon, it's going to be more of a rain snow mix type of deal. And then by the later on in the evening, we'll see it turn basically to all snow. In southern Minnesota, we're expecting it to be pretty scattered and pretty light. So very little accumulation is expected, if any. It's likely that most of us will just see a dusting, although it could be a little bit closer to an inch in northern Iowa. But the ground is very still is still very warm. So it's going to be hard to really maintain um, any type of accumulation. 37 later on this afternoon is going to be about the warmest it gets. Tonight we're going to see our temperatures reach the 20s. It's going to be very chilly out there heading into this upcoming weekend. Snow showers Saturday, drying out Sunday. Good news is we are seeing high temperature or high pressure move in this upcoming week. So not going to reflect it in the temperatures, but we will see a lack of rain and also hopefully a little bit more sunshine to go along with this upcoming week. A little bit of a warm towards the end of the week, but in general that cold season is here. We'll be right back.